Greetings, I, the War Owl, greets you, and welcome to Unbox of Fragathon, the show that drains my wallet faster than my addiction to junk food. Jalapeno potato chips. They were put on this earth for two conflicting reasons. To kill me, and to make life worth living. This time we're going to be opening five of the brand new Chroma 2 cases. You know this video is coming. New case comes out. Got to do an Unbox Fragathon. And all we get are da Dazzly Dazzle Dazzle Negevs here. Um, we shall be getting 10 frags inside of a Valve Deathmatch server. This is an ugly skin. The case and the key cost $6.86. Actual retail price of the Negev bedazzled, 42 cents. You guys like the whole how much money did we waste from the last time? So that's something that we're going to be carrying over here as we move on to the first case today. And that is going to be our Negev. I say this every time we come across the Negev. And that is... Use it like a rifle. I seem to be spraying with it, though. There we go. Boom headshot. Thing is a very, very, very powerful bullets. Good for them tap headshots. None can stop me. Let's see if we can get to, uh... uh, uh okay, free AFK kill. Let's see if we can get to 10 without dying once. That would be awesome. That's now my mission, guys. I've created like a sub... A sub goal. Or what do you call it? Like a side quest? What are we at? Nine. One more and we've completed side quest. Do it without dying. Achievement unlocked. Here we go. One more enemy to fell. One more terrorist to destroy. Not that one. Oh. Oh. Oh! I did it! I did it, guys! Next case. I think 10 is too too quick. Second case is a thumbnail. There's a thumbnail in there somewhere. Stat track UMP45. Um this is a weird looking skin. Oh, I get it. Briefing. It's supposed to look like All right, team, we're going to be entering through the egress point in the southwest. Actual retail price $3.36. We get a minute left of vertigo. I have to do my trick. I ha- I don't even care about the frags right now. I gotta do my trick. Don't you- you will not stop me. Alright, guys. I l I learned this trick in Nam. Are you ready? Let's hope I remembered it. Don't you dare. Huzzah! Yes! <laughs> huh. Alright, um... Ignore the fact that this UMP already has a, a million frags on it. Uh, oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Wow, I should not have survived that. <laughs> it didn't just so happen that I uh, completely... Lo Where did he come from? Completely lost the recording of the webcam for this, so I had to re-record it. And now I have 20 seconds to get enough frags to move on. What? That was weird. I thought there was somebody behind me. Oh! Uh! <laughs> Am I done? So I don't even know how I'm going to edit the last part. I was getting massive lag spikes. I don't know what I'm going to do with the footage, but we're just going to roll with it. Uh, fun fact, guys. It's illegal for your ISP to throttle you. Fun fact, guys. They do it anyway, and there's nothing you can do about it except get a VPN. So I'm VPNing to New York right now, and my ping has gone down from about 250, 300, down to like 40 to on, the, on the same server. Uh, if that's not proof that they're throttling me, then I don't know what is. Alright, third case. It just, it makes me so mad. It makes me so mad that they do it and they get away with it. And we got our second stat track of the day. So there's that. So I got that going for me. Actual retail price, $3.85. Oh. I don't know what I'm doing, dude. I don't know what I'm doing. Google Fiber. I am going to be moving once Google Fiber gets installed where I am. T-Side Auto Sniper. This is actually rarely purchased because Terrorist Side, you're generally not going to purchase an Auto Sniper, but it's used the same way as the other Auto, where you're going to be going for um, body shots. It's really easy. You just click, click, click. Very, because it's such an easy weapon to use, um, a lot of people think it's cheap and unfair, 
but I think it's balanced and it has its uses inside of competitive play because of how expensive it is. It's a huge risk. And remember in Counter-Strike, if you die, you can give that weapon to your opponents. So it evens out. We've got, uh, we've got rubber banding naturally built into the game, guys. We're good to go. It, it is so easy to use. I had to reload it. That's, that's not a good sign for my opponents. Oh my gosh. With a freaking auto sniper, I got taken out by a USP player. Three frags left. Yeah, so um, they're installing Google Fiber right now. They won't be installing it in my area because I live in a poor area. However, am I done? Let's get a few more. Let's do it. Let's do it based on stat track. Um, so bots don't count. Um, so I will be moving to an area that has Google Fiber when it's installed. That is how important internet connection is to me. That is how much of a nerd I am. It's very important for my business, you know? Which is what I'm doing right now here with you. Chilling and playing video games. What a business, guys. What a business. I am pretty much living the dream right now. There are a lot of bots, and we might never finish because of all of the bots. Oh, boom headshot. Wow. I'm excited, man. I got a good shot, finally. I like that. I'm such a bad, like, um, let's play type person. It's like, all right, guys, we're going to be pushing into the site here and trying to get some frags. I don't have very much emotions. And, uh, oh, boy. I am excited. I've got to say what my mood is. Otherwise, you won't understand, right? Because you can't really tell with me. I'm just not. I'm just not a very uh, excitable fellow. But that got me excited. Why am I doing that accent? There's not even. There's not even one of those people who does that accent. That is so random. Why am I only coming across bots? There we go. We're done. Fourth case of the day. We put voice enable on, and that means we will chat with the denizens of Valve Deathmatch servers. This will be exciting. We'll have 64 tick conversations. We have not had a duplicate today, and we have had lots of stat tracks, so even though they're all blues, I'm totally okay with it. I, you know what, we'll tally up the numbers afterwards, though. Uh, I don't know, guys. I don't, I like, I'll, okay, I'll just, I'm gonna level with you. I don't give a crap about skins. I know this is the part where I'm supposed to be like, huh, well, that one looks pretty cool, huh? I don't give a crap. Actual retail price, $2.44. When I was doing the voice, I should have been, I'm not a very excitable fellow. I don't know why. I felt like it would have made it funnier. Did I just get a long range shotgun headshot? Wow, that just happened. Wow, what is happening? I heard it. I got another one. I got another one, guys. Auto shoddy? No, 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 no. Auto shoddy OP? Question mark? Oh, um. Uh, hi there. You're I'm actually white. I'm triggered. Yeah, um. Many people find that term offensive, so I would ask you very kindly to not use such language. Why also, God, people say it up the time. Like, what? What's up? Also, would you mind turning off your microphone no, because it is as there's a very bad like background sound, and it's hurting my brain right now. Like, what's up, my? You look like listen, a low listen. Let's let's just. Can we just have a little conversation healer? I want to I want to understand what's going on with you, man. I want to understand if if there's something, you know, something in your childhood we could talk about, you know, just to you know, get you on a level. I'm a Kirsten, like and this is my pawn shop. That was a terrible voice crack. You should get AIDS. Let's just I just before I go, I just want you to say something human to me. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Yes. Is that better? No, but just can you just one just say something human as if I were another human being without trying to be offensive or racist or anything like that. 
or or to troll or whatever it is since you have trouble talking to people I just like I'm another person I just want to hear something human from you so I know that there is there is some hope in this world how to be a family is he gone did he leave there's no I can't get through to these kids man I tried you know I feel like his daddy wasn't there for him and you know I could be I could be that daddy you know I got to see his mom first before I make that decision though um, final case of the day uh, lesson of the day don't be racist all right and we got an SG triarch and it looks like um, a fanatic skin rest in peace fanatic actual retail price one dollar and eighty five cents Grand total loss for the video, $22.38. With that money, you could have bought yourself a nice steak dinner. So for the final case of the day, our new tradition is we're going to get real like we did before. Fifth case of the day, we get real. That's our new thing. And something I just want to talk about, that kid that we came across who was yelling racial slurs and just kind of being as offensive as he can possibly be intentionally. Um, I don't know, it's easy to write those type of people off and just say, it's just some kid who's trying to get attention and that's the only way he knows how. He's trying to be edgy, you know, he doesn't really understand. Um, but I think there's more to it than that. Um, I might... The spray with this gun is so tough because it's... It does not go up. It goes up and to the right completely. Anyway, back to the non-gameplay side of things. There's this, like, weird... The weird zeitgeist these days of being perpetually offended by every little thing that happens. And not even be being offended for yourself. Being offended for other people. And it's silly. It's goofy. It's obnoxious. Uh, it's easy to make fun of. And it's fun to make fun of. But I think an unfortunate side effect of this is an unfortunate side effect of that subculture is this counterculture that has emerged where people are just being as offensive as they can possibly be um, in order to, I don't know, counteract it. I don't even know what point they're trying to prove. They yell racial slurs. They try and, uh, try and upset people, and that's pretty much just how they conduct themselves. And it's something I've noticed more and more recently in just the past few years. It's really upsetting to me because, in my opinion, um, I think when you come across a person, whether it be online uh, or in person, it's important to show that person the proper respect, uh, especially if you've never met them before and you don't know them or anything. I think it's important to respect people. And you have these people, they're, they're uh, <clears throat> role models these days, teach them to intentionally disrespect people, to be, you know... Being a rebel is just being a, a complete dick. Saying racist or, or uh, uh, offensive things. And, like I'm saying, this I, I don't agree with the people who are perpetually offended. But I don't think that me that sort of gives you a right to be as offensive as you can. The only thing you're proving is that you're a dick. Thank you folks very much for watching. I am the War Owl. And I still have no closer. Nothing? Hey, Warrell, what's the best way to hold B sight on Dust One? Best way to hold B sight on Dust One? You don't have to, because they're gonna go A sight on Dust One. See, trick question.